right, I'm going to show you how to cut down a box to properly fit uh, all the packing material for shipping. I've already done some of the preliminaries, but you pack the box as it's going to ship with all packing material on all sides. Then you see where that packing material rises up to in the box and mark it on the corners and along the sides. You can see here I've already done that with the Sharpie. So you remove the top half of the packing material as it sits now and take a box cutter, cut through the cardboard up the sides and the corners because what we're doing is creating extra flaps. Then take your cutter and score, just lightly run it along the line inside the box, not through the cardboard, just breaking the inner surface. Once that's done, you put this back here, put your hands here, break it down, fold it back down, you get a good cut on that. And once you fold all four sides down, you created basically new flats. Then you repack the material inside. You can fold the flaps back down, and at this point, you can either cut off the excess flap or leave it on as more additional packing material. Take the box and ship it and that way. You've got a smaller box that fits the package correctly and there's no room for it to move around. Pack it, ship it, and then you should be good.